it was originally pointed out by my second opponent that the use of drones contributes to um, a negative emotional feeling of the victims. The same could be said for any sort of warfare and does not constitute the removal of drones as a whole. He mentioned a story of a citizen who lost their entire family in a drone strike, as well as another instance where an entire wedding full of people was killed all by one attack. Regardless of the fact if they were combatants or not, um, my opponent only addressed the use of drones from an emotional standpoint. Um, the same could be accomplished by regular attacks, and this implies that it's not the use of drones that is the immoral part of warfare, it's the warfare itself. So it's not a question of whether or not the drones are causing the death to civilians, or even if they're causing an abnormal amount of civilian deaths. It's whether or not the warfare itself constitutes the use of the drones. Um, stemming from the immorality claims, um, it was claimed by my opponent originally that um, the drones were horribly inaccurate and contributed to the all-out warfare aspect of uh, nations. Um, as previously stated, it's not the drones themselves that cause all of these issues. The inaccuracy can be contributed to the inability of um, guidance systems and uh, targeting systems to be accurate, but it removes the human error aspect of warfare. As technology advances and targeting increases its abilities to pick out unique targets individually, the concern for civilian casualties will completely diminish. And it's because of this that not only would removing drones cause detriment to the life of the United States as a whole, but it would also um, contribute to a negative effect on the technological advancements of nations. As stated previously by one of my opponents, drone use in military uh, militarized attacks contributes to the mental state, the I'm sorry, the negative mental state of operators and civilians. This once again could be contributed to the warfare itself and not particularly the drones, as well as um, being used as an emotional pull from the audience to imply that the drones themselves are causing damage to humans. It is because of these points that I would like to end my part of the speech by saying that drones should not be removed from militarized actions between nations.